Racing star Jean-Francois. The WS Cox Plate Racing's heavyweight championship is won only by great horses. From Farlap to Tullock, rising fast to Kingston Town. It's a race of pure quality and emotions are at their highest. Dan Maliki looks at the history of the Cox Plate. The Cox Plate immortalises the triumphant. The list of winners is a trip down memory lane. Ordinary horses just don't win this blue ribbon event. Farlap in 1930 and 31. Tullock in 1960. Rising fast, the last horse to win the Triple Crown, consisting of the Caulfield and Melbourne Cups and the Plate in 1954. Tobin Bronze in 66 and 67, and Gun Sind in 72. The champion Dulcify streeted them in 1979. Dulcify brilliantly wins the Cox Plate by six lengths. Kingston Town dominated the Cox Plate for three years in the early 80s. The 1986 race was described as one of the best ever. Bonecrusher and Waverley start the Bonecrusher! And last year, Elmered dominated the spring and fittingly won the most glamorous horse race in Australia. Elmered and Michael Clark get the Starley Century and Elmered wins! Elmered wins! He ran second in last year's Cox Plate, and he's got the quality to match his looks. Styly Century is my tip in the WS Cox Plate. To the Mooney Valley tips, Quadrella 3558, Quad Extra 514, 8 and 1. <laughs> in the Daily Double, in the first league, the Cox Plate, 5 Styly Century, maybe that was an omen, from 6 Horlicks and 2 Better Loosen Up, into 8 Street Ruffian, 1 Redelver and 2 Gallipoli Prince. And the lucky long shot, of course, is race 5, number 5, Stylish Century.